Hello everybody and welcome back to my hardcore combat only speedrun mode. Today my three goals are to get the ancient claw for my melee kit. You can see I did form the volcanic cave a bunch so I've got the full ancient kit and the dragon fire shield. Sunset rapier, paladin gloves, you know the deal. But we want to get ancient claw. Then after we get ancient claw I want to go in and beat the air god dungeon. Clear that as many times as we can. Get range gear. My range is already level 89 and we have a bunch of bolts so we'll get all that. Go into the water god dungeon and clear that and those are my three goals for this video. So I'm gonna sit here for a bit and grind these guys and get back to you once I have all the components and I upgrade it Okay, just got the last one I needed. We're gonna go ahead and upgrade this boom very nice Go ahead and throw that on we already have the dragon claw as well So we don't have to go grind that we're gonna want both of them for infernal claw later But for right now though, I'm gonna throw on the silver diamond ring. I'm gonna throw on some prayers I think instead of this I'm gonna run stone skin for the 3% extra damage reduction and we're going to go in here and try and do this. I think 412 auto eat and 47% DR is going to be good enough. So let's give this a go. Let's give it a try. Okay, first floor is clear. That was pretty easy. Second floor looks like it's going to be more of the same. Super duper easy. Going to keep an eye on it. Got to make sure nothing can kill me while I'm stunned either. Maybe I'll do, instead of this, I'll do um, protect from ranged. So these guys can't stun me as much. Oh, now I'm missing a lot though. I think this is better. Increasing my chance to hit by like 11%. I can deal with this stun. Okay, third floor is done. Onto Aileron. Can't kill me. Kind of close though. But this is like the melee check. So, gotta make sure I don't make the same mistake I did last time and go into the god dungeon with the wrong kid on. That's how I lost my other character. Okay, this is slow. Vault air super easy because I get the extra damage reduction from the combat triangle. Chance to hit is still kind of low though. And then here's Eris. Yeah, I think I'm good here. Yeah, I'm good here. So we're gonna get through this first clear. We're going to open up that first scroll and see what I can get out of it. Hopefully I can get some ranged boots or gloves and that would make my melee character stronger. I can take off stone skin and throw on a better prayer. We should get boots or gloves. I think gloves would be better. I don't really think we need stone skin, but I just want to play it safe. Don't like risking it. Okay, that's done. Let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. Boom. We got the boots. That's fine. Um, So they do give us, like they don't take away from anything, but they give us less strength. Um, but that's fine. I'm just going to throw these on. They give us 3% extra damage reduction. That means I'm safe to take off stone skin and I can put on like piety um, and that should increase my my clear speed by a significant amount um, but I'm gonna go through this a bunch of times until I get a decent amount of ranged gear uh, and then we're gonna move on so I'll see you guys in a little bit all right guys I've been grinding this for a little bit now I think I have enough ranged kit um, to go into the next dungeon I'm gonna throw on dragon fire shield on my ranged just because i think that's the best thing i can do it gives me extra hit points which i think i'll need for this um but we're at 50 percent dr i'll throw on rigor and protect for magic 50 percent. i think this is good let's give it a go i'm pretty confident I, I really don't think that anything will be able to kill us we're gonna have a go at this this should go a lot faster first floor is about to be clear i don't think anything will be able to kill us honestly yeah floor two these are melee characters so it's a little a little more rough I think it's probably fine. Honestly, I could sit in here and manually change the protection just to save myself some food. But the main one of them is unavoidable. Or a lot, but two of them are unavoidable. But we're done with that now. Go back to protect from magic. I'm probably only going to clear this once or twice because I can't equip any of this on magic right now. I still need to work on getting magic up. Um, I haven't really been able to because of the how difficult it is to get runes. I don't have that many good runes, um, but... I figured gearing up range would be a good opportunity um, to make grinding runes a little bit easier. You know, getting the range strength bonus and range attack bonus and stuff like that will make killing those wizards really, really easy. Um, so I can grind that out, especially now that I can use ancient magic. Um, but ancient runes are like borderline impossible to get. I mean, honestly, I could probably idle Hall of Wizards. And I mean, that even that is like, meh. But I think I can get ancient runes from these, the chests, the water chests. Oh yeah, speaking of that, let's go ahead and open up our air chests. See if we get any cool amulets. Nope. Just a bunch of this stuff. I am maxed out right now on bank space. I've got the maximum amount of slots for hardcore. Okay, we're on a Mert Mertia, which is like the, the check, kind of, for ranged. He does sun, he does freeze. It's big yikes. The slow is really annoying. Unavoidable slow, unavoidable freeze. And he does the slow almost half the time, which is really, really annoying. But he's about to be dead. Okay, he's dead. There's Glacia, the final boss. And we're pretty safe. Yeah, we're pretty safe. Nice. I'll probably hang out on some of the trash mobs to, just to get enough water shards to get the water chest. Okay, there's, there's enough. So we're going to open up the scroll. Like I said, I'm not able to use any of this stuff yet. The boots, that's pretty par for the course. Open the chest. Uh, I do think, can we get ancient runes in here? 
Yes, up to a thousand. So this is going to be how I get my ancient runes for sure. Um, I can also get blood runes, which I think is for a pretty solid one. Yeah, these ones right here, the waves, which are like way better than what I've been using. They only need one of the catalyst runes and I just got 970 of those or 908. So that's pretty solid. Uh, that's probably how I'll grind out my my runes, but I definitely want to use the more garbage runes to try and level up magic to 85. So between this episode and next episode, I'll definitely do that. I don't have much else to talk about. Uh, I did get Slayer up to 94, Prayers up to 96 because I've basically been running it all the time. Because of the Slayer packages, we get so many prayer points that it's really just always worth it to have that going. Everything else is pretty high. Strength is up to 102, hit points is 99, attack 92, defense 95. Ranged is almost 90. But yeah, I've been Captain Blomo. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more episodes. Join the Discord, and I'll see you next time. Peace.